what's up again YouTube and I'm going to be also installing these Empire Collection passenger foot pegs on this 23 CVO Road Glide and um, these are the parts that I'm going to be adding on. I'm going to be removing the original um, foot pegs that came back here. These just provide a flatter surface and they're not extremely large as um, some of the other style foot pegs that I'll show you. So those are the other passenger style foot pegs that I was talking about. Well, they're not even foot pegs, but they're floorboards to go with those Empire Collection type floorboards for the rider. So instead of putting those on, I'm going to be installing these because it's just um, this is this is a lot of space to go right here. And um, so that's why I decided to go with that and we'll see how it looks. A little different, but they don't make anything to uh, to match this series right here. So I had went with Empire there, and so I'm going to go with Empire back here. So to do that, you have a pin right here. See the style pin that that takes. I have these pliers that go specifically in there. So they're spring um, spring loaded pliers. I'm not sure what the the name or type these are but I remember having them for another project that I was working on so you basically stick these sharp uh, noses there into the uh, the uh, the pin and then you pull it out to release you don't want to spread them too far because you'll damage the um, the actual pin and you need to put it back so I'm gonna be removing that in order to remove this hardware and I'll be right back all right, so as mentioned, I was able to line them up, put them in, and then spread them apart like that, and then slide down. That permits this pin to now um, come all the way out. Like that, and you wanna put it back in the same way. So I'm just gonna sit that up there. I'll sit it right here, it's probably gonna, so it doesn't fall. And I wanna hold these pieces together everything so they don't fall out and then put the other part back in. So you see that's the way it was and the good thing about recording this is I can go, always go back and um, look at this again to see how things go. So I know my one buddy who always watches says, Chris get a tripod. I know, <laughs> but uh, so it makes it more challenging and fun. Put that back in. And that's in place. And now I have to put the pin back in. Grab it from up here. And put that in place. And move back and forth until I get it in. All right, so I have that on there. I have everything in place. I just have to take this and press it back in to get it back on there. And, um, there are tools that I have to uh, go ahead and spread that apart and put it back on. All right, so just like that, they're on. They move and they stay up just like how the other ones did before. And that's the after, and this is the before. And so there's more foot platform or surface platform to place the foot there than you had before, slightly a little bit more. And so it's not as big as those, but it does the trick. So a little bit more foot comfort. And um, I may just go ahead and change that out to the remaining parts of the Empire series. So now I just gotta go and do the other side. So for this side, I'm gonna use these 90 degree bent tip um, circle clip pliers. Um, one set when you press, spreads them apart and the other set when you press it closes right so when I put the other ones back on I actually closed them and then see as you can see I had to sharpen these for another project I think I was using them for my um, one of the bikes for um, the clutch levers or something else that I was changing out so but anyway, just do the same thing on this side and um, I'll be done. 
All right, so there's the uh, clip we got out. Just like I said, remove that, pull this out, this other piece fall out, and it just goes, goes against the uh, that side right there, as you saw before. And now just put the other piece on there. Stand by. Stick that on. Push this through. Got to line it up. All right, so I was able to use the other ones and slip it past. So these prongs go inside the holes there. And just takes a little patience. I got one in. Once I get the other one in, all I'm going to do is close it up some by pushing it together. Closing it just like that to tighten it. And um, they'll probably recommend using brand new ones when you put another set on. And um, I'm confident that they're not going to back out. So if they do, it will be... And it's not gonna pass anything. But I'm confident that it'll be fine. I can buy some new ones. They're probably really cheap. And um, but they aren't good enough. Just test them out. Alright, and just like that, we are done installing these passenger um, foot pegs. They're like mini floorboards. They're made by the Empire Collection. They still call them passenger foot pegs. But like I mentioned, they're not as large as those, but um, it's pretty cool looking. It gives you more of a, your passenger more of a flat um, surface to, to put their foot on. So um, your passengers don't complain about having a sore foot from the regular like peg style. And so we'll see how it works. Um, I didn't have any complaints on the other ones, but it's just years and years and years ago, I heard that. Um, from someone so just want to keep those switched out and again want to thank you guys for watching another episode of chris glides and stay tuned because who knows where we're gonna go next take care